we begin marking out by collecting our tri-square, our marking out pencil and our ruler. And then we inspect our timber to look for natural defects. Natural defects like these are perfectly natural. They're part of the, the old branches that used to hang off the side of the tree trunk. If we don't like them, we mark out around them and just avoid that area. We start out our marking out by taking our tri-square, putting the stock of our tri-square against the side of our timber and running the blade across. We do this by placing it on, on, the, on the piece of timber, like this, and we squeeze the stock against the side of the piece of timber and use our pencil to draw a nice 90 degree line across. Once that first line is done, we do our first marking out from that line. Our marking out can be done along here using the pencil to reference the point and while we've got the pencil in that point we can put our tri-square in place and we can do the next line. Usually we leave a small gap between each part to allow for sawing and later on disc sanding. A gap of about five millimetres will usually be enough. Then we mark out from that line our second distance. and so on along our plank of timber. <laughs> 